Welcome back to my kitchen. I've tried cooking cauliflower rice on my own before and not had great success with it. I like it mashed and I did a video about that earlier. I can link it below, but I've not had luck with it as a rice. One of my favorite fast, fast casual places is called Zoe's Kitchen. They do Mediterranean food. And when they started offering cauliflower rice, I decided to see how they do with it. What I got is called a cauliflower rice bowl. It has feta on it. I could get it without the feta if I wanted it. It has cauliflower rice. It is gluten free, I think, and I got it with falafel. So it's not super low carb because falafel is never going to be super low carb. It looks like it has some kind of cucumber salad there, which is going to be my favorite part probably. Cauliflower rice. It's cold. I wasn't expecting that. It's not bad actually. The seasoning they put with it is Israeli shug. I had the option to switch to harissa, which I probably will do next time because I like harissa. I wanted to go ahead and try it the way they recommend it. Cucumbers are good. But this whole plate was under 500 calories, I think. So that's a nice amount of food for under 500 calories. This is definitely cooked longer to be softer than the way that I've done it in the past. Really doesn't taste that much like cauliflower because it has a lot of seasonings in it. Definitely lots of cilantro. The texture of this is different from when you buy cauliflower rice, this is kind of chopped fine. And this is actually like longer. It's almost like orzo pasta in the shape. No idea how you would do that. I guess you would need your own ricer. It's pretty good. Let me know in the comments if you'd like to see me try to figure out this rice thing on my own. See you Sunday!